All right, Shalom. I want to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shad Bashim, Rakakadash, the bonus of the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. Peace, blessings, and salutations to you, sincere Akim out there, pushing the truth across the four corners of the earth. All right, and, um, you know, Shalom to you, sincere sisters, listening and learning as well. I'm brother Preach Your Mind from uh, Great Millstone, Chicago. Um, just real quick, uh, Cause it's a it's a it's a spirit out here, man. It's just and it, it always happens like this, man. It's always a trend of uh, wickedness, you know, going you know, stemming from the spiritual demon Satan, and then and of course going through Esau, you know, going through uh, uh, the wicked, the wicked of uh, the nation of Israel. You know, we we put prayers up and you know we watch over each other so that that spirit doesn't jump into Israel, but then. You know, you have a lot of our people who they don't have a covering against, you know, these tr different wicked trends of Esau, man, and it's different filth. All right. Like you just had uh, the inauguration and uh, they made sure that they put, you know, Jennifer Lopez, you know, in the forefront. They put uh, fucking Lady Gaga, which, you know, I believe she's an Israelite. All right. They had Black Lives Matter, you know, putting up twerk videos, you know, once again, the the the, uh, the 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 uh the the woman you know the end dub and uh it's just a trend man where esau is using using the woman as a point of an indoctrination you know for the nation of israel all right and then and of course kamala harris who's trying to play the part of a black woman because she's in you know a sorority which that's what you niggas that's what you Negroes get for, you know, becoming Greek and joining that that lifestyle. Now you're being used as a shield for, you know, Esau to be able to uh, come and uh, bring his agenda in, into, you know, our nation. All right, but at the end of the day, there is a separation between, you know, the nation of Israel and between, you know, people who happen to be Israelites in a, in a Babylonian state of mind. All right, and that's why that's where the whole concept of uh, Israelites becoming heathens come because you had a lot of our people who were carried away through slavery, or they just left, and they became uh, they became heathens. They became in the way of the heathens, so they became like a heathen. All right, and this is all due due to captivity. All right, and people uh, you know becoming disenchanted with uh, who they were, or or just you know, pretty much leaving and getting out of it. And we see these trends, you know, most of all in the New Testament, that's who uh, Paul was dealing with. All right, Israelites who were spread out through the four corners of the earth. Right, but this happened on my channel. It says, uh, hey, we wanted you to know that our team has reviewed your content and we don't think it's in line with our community guidelines. As a result, we've age restricted the following content. Uh, yeah, they're they, they, they age restricted. Because right, one of the things that the scriptures does, so I'm gonna go right to it. So lock you for talking too much, but you know, it's, it's, it's just you, you got to say it out loud, man. You gotta, you gotta, you got to uh, confess it. It says Psalms 119 and 9. Wherewithal shall a young man cleanse his way by taking heed thereto according to thy word, right, and. Uh, the number one thing we know, you know, that was done in Babylon before, you know, they took all of the children, you know, who were uh, able to uh, have a certain mindset, you know, certain children of a certain understanding, which, you know, they do that here. Uh, they give you these different test scores and, you know, they test them at an early age, you know, who's advanced in reading, who can put shapes together, who can, you know, who can uh, understand, you know higher level things and then you know they then they, they indoctrinate you put you in the these different programs where you know they really want to program you and um, in order for you to be used as a a uh, leader you know to fool your people all right and that word indoctrination is important let's see indoctrination here it is indoctrination all right, that's that's basically what they were trying to do. What Nebuchadnezzar was trying to do with Daniel and his friends. This is formally also indoctrinate to teach. 
form, formed as if from Latin, but there seems to have been no word in doctrinaire, perhaps modeled on French and doctrinaire, or, or extended from earlier, now obsolete verb in doctrine, in doctrine to instruct, right? So basically, indoctrination, you receive an instruction, uh, which we're being indoctrinated with the word of the Lord, which is a pure and righteous thing. But two thirds of our people, it says that under every uh, high hill and green tree, so that being indoctrinated in the way of the wicked. All right? And you're seeing that play out now with um, with Jake, who decided to uh, hold hands with Esau, because the scripture talks about make no covenant with the heathen. All right? You're not supposed to stand against your own people you know, on the side of Esau, thinking that just because you're going to get some goodies or you, you're going to get something, you know, you, 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 you know, sell your soul, you sign that contract, that all of a sudden everything is going to be good and you're going to be living it up, you know. And Daniel and his Daniel and his, his three friends, they knew that, all right. That's why ultimately when they were set up uh, in Esau's kingdom as, as leaders, Daniel himself was a president. Right? He was one of the, the top servants, but they were set up. But they were set up in righteousness. Right? They, they they kept the law, statutes, and commandments, and that was the only thing that, that the other uh, 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 rulers of the different provinces, that's the only thing they could find against Daniel, right? that he followed the laws of the Most High, which, you know, today, <laughs> you, you, you can't even do that. They've cut that off and made that, you know, obsolete, basically. Uh, and this is all through the wicked. It said, With my whole heart have I sought thee. Oh, let me not wonder from thy commandments. Exactly. It said, Thy word have I hid in my heart that I might not sin against thee. And all of this, plus, uh, you know, what I showed you with the whole YouTube age restriction. Because that's one thing I noticed, too. When they go after the videos, they're going after our elders first and foremost. Right, they're going after the apostles, you know, going after their channels, they're going after the elders, you know, then the young men, you know, then they'll, they'll come and they'll fuck with our stuff, but they go after the elders first because they know, you know, basically, man, that's, that's, that's where the, the purest form of the word is coming from. All right, it says, uh, what is that one? Yeah, Wisdom of Solomon 8. In fact, let's start at, um, Verse 8, it said, If a man desire much experience, she knoweth things of old, some of wisdom, of course, and conjectureth aright what is to come. She knoweth the subtilities of speeches and can expound dark sentences. She foreseeth signs and wonders in the events of seasons and times. And the thing about it, man, you know, sitting, sitting amongst, being able to sit around the elders and being able to listen and hear things for a few years now, one of the things that they're going to teach you and show you is the sweet and the bitter. Right? You're going to get the full understanding, man. You're not just going to get, you know, the the the, the uh, perpetual, you know, the perpetual uh, thing where people are kissing your ass but working against you, you know, which that's pretty much what the, this new uh, uh, the, the the new leadership of Esau, you know, Biden Harris. That's pretty much what they're going to do. All right. That's why they, like I said, rolled out the red carpet for the, the the uh, the woman, the woman. All right. They let them perform, put on a show. You know, this land is your land. All this shit. You know what I'm saying? You know, paraded out. Uh, oh, Michelle Obama. <laughs> you know, this this is all a distraction, man. It's all a show, man. You know, they did all of that because once again, Esau. And Eve, you know, once Esau goes down, Eve goes down. And a lot of these, these Israelite women, well, they don't know that they're Israelite. Or well, maybe they do. But, uh, but a lot of these Israelite women, they know that. And that's why they were riding so hard, you know, with with uh, with Esau. Because they know that this is their last go around, man. Or maybe they don't, but guess what? It don't matter. This is their last go around, <laughs> you know. But they know once Esau goes down, we come back up, all right? And that's what they're trying to do. They're trying to cut off the voice, man. 
especially the voice of the elders. Let me get back to a Salaka. It says, therefore, I purpose in uh, well, verse at chapter verse eight. It says what things of old in order to know things of old, you got to ask about those. man. There's a certain thing, you know, certain things you can probably look. You can look in the article or you can find on YouTube. But there's certain things you have to ask people who are older than you. Or you got brothers who, you know, you got brothers who have served in these different world wars, man, who've been all over the world. You got brothers who've traveled, you know, who've owned businesses, you know, all this stuff. All right, it says, uh, she know of subtilities of speeches, and, you know, that's that's another thing, man. The elders, they've heard the, the, the older uh, uh, brothers, too. They've heard a lot of these different leaders speak, you know, and seen the results and the actions behind that. You know what I'm saying? Who better to know and, and tell you what's really going to happen than somebody who's heard, you know, the play being run a thousand times. All right. It said, and can expound dark sentences. She foreseeth signs and, one, and seasons and times, you know, where the season and the time that we're in, you know, where they have to send troops to the capital. You know, you have to ask yourself, you know, what, what am I doing? You know, if you're not, you know, with this word, if you're not fighting, you know, if you don't have faith in the Lord, you know, what, what, what's going to happen to you? What, what's going to be uh, the, the result of uh, this current administration? Because they're pushing against Jake, all right, especially the, the men, pushing against the men. The women, too, they're coming for the women, too, you know, just in, in a more sub, subtle way, just like I said, subtlety of speeches. All right, verse 9, therefore I purpose to take her to me to live with me, knowing that she would be a counsel of good things and a comfort and cares of, and, and grief. For her sake I have estimation among the multitude and honor with the elders, though I be young. And there you go. Because that's ultimately what you want, man. You want you want honor among your elders. You want to honor them, and you want them to honor you, man. And that respect is very important. And that's why they're trying to cut off the voice of the elders, you know. They're trying to destroy, you know, the image of the elders because they're from an era, you know, a completely different era than the one that we're in now where everything is, is just uh, complete folly, you know what I'm saying? Now, it was folly then too, but, you know, this, this era is just complete folly, man. This is that adulterous generation. Uh, now, they'll sit here and age-restrict uh, our videos and stuff, but... You know, if you, uh, I'm sure if you created a new profile, you know, you put, you know, that you were 14 or something, guess what's going to be in your recommendations? You know, NBA young boy, all these, these, these kid rappers, Lil this, young that, you know, baby this, right? And then also, too, they're going to promote G, they're going to promote the letters, man. I'm not going to say them because they're going to flag this video. They're going to promote, uh, all of the different uh, uh, <laughs> alternate lifestyle, <laughs> you know, for you to, hey, for, for, for other social media platforms too, because that's, that's in uh, Biden's, that's in one of his executive orders, all right, a push for that. And not only a push, but they want to start, te they want to teach this directly to your kids. And this just goes to show you that this is the, uh, the league of uh, the elites because, you know, Trump, you know, he's complaining about he was cheated. He's supposed to be in there, whatever. But Esau always makes sure that you get both sides, all right? Which, you know, Trump was riding kind of hard on that right wing, so now they got to, you know, play off the left wing, left wing for a while. All right, then people start to catch on to that game. Then they got to go back with the right wing. You know, Esau has, has done this the whole time. He's done it the whole time, man. Left wing, right wing, it's the same animal. All right, it says, um, let's see, that, that was it on that. All right, it, it, but the scriptures talk about hearing the discourse of the elders. What is that? that? It's the discourse of the elders. All right, because that's what you want to hold on to, especially in the times coming, man. You know, not only, not only you know, in a physical sense do you have uh, warriors, but spiritual sense, first and foremost, man. You have men who have been around this long and seen all these different things and it would be wise to uh utilize that and, and listen to that right, especially for young men this is Sirach 6 and 34 they'll stand in the multitude of the elders and cleave unto him that is wise be willing to hear every godly discourse 
and not the parables of, of understanding escape thee. All right, especially in these times now, man, you better understand what's going on. You better understand the plot of the enemy. All right. You got you got the guy who created the crime bill. You got you know Kamala Harris who she been locking people up. You know I don't know why. You know people are letting them you know spin this little you know black girl magic narrative, but it, it, it's it's not it's not looking good for Jake, man. It's not looking good. All right. Hey, we know Biden is the one who. Uh, who 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 told the the the, the uh, I believe it was another senator, might have been a judge, you know? Can a microchip be implanted inside? He's the one who said that. I, Apostle Tahar had the video up on his channel. You know, of course they, I think they they, they took that down. But yeah, he, he that's that's something that that Great Millstone has been pushing for a long time, and that's the first time I saw that video. You know, uh, looking through, you know. And uh, studying under the, the elders and the apostles once again. All right, it says uh, Psalms 119. Let's see, it was another one though. Where is it at? Can't find it. All right, well, to what? Right, Cause let's look at the let's let's see what this says about the real doctrine. What what should your real indoctrination be? That's a good one, Isaiah twenty-eight nine. Uh, that's not what I wanted though. All right, here we go. 2 Timothy 3.16. All right, it said, All scripture is given by inspiration of the Most High and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness. All right. Like you had the spirit pop up on those, uh, I'm not going to say their name, but those one guys, you know, they're, they're talking about G Great Millstone is a bunch of liars and rebuke and, you know, the mark of the beast is, is, is uh, not physical or something like that. Uh, here it is. You got you know just 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 thinking logically. You have men who have been studying and researching diligently for thirty years, twenty years, thirty years, how ten years, how, however many years, you know, who've seen all these different things. All of a sudden, you jump in, and you know more than them. You know, even even in 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 the world, you know, if you're in the field for so long, doing research for so long. You know, somebody who, you know, just jumps in usually, you know, unless they're just, you know, just a, a fucking guru, you know, which it's, it's just, it still shouldn't happen. If you've been in something 30 years, 20 years or whatever, somebody shouldn't be able to just come in and just know more than you, you know, right? especially if you're diligent about that field. All right? it, it, it doesn't happen, man, point blank period. All right, it doesn't happen. You know, even, even in the NBA, you know, which... That's that's more of a corner thing, less less than a mental thing. But you know the the the, the rookies that come in, you know they might be so good, they might have the athletic talent, but they don't have the mental sharpness of a of a veteran. You know what I'm saying? And that's just that's just how it goes, man. That's why once again, man, it's important to be around you know these different men. You know what I'm saying? And 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 uh, you know a lot of times uh, you know because. You know, when you're around older brothers, you know, they, they expect certain things. Some of them can be, the scripture talks about that. Some of them can be a little softer. You know, some of them can be a little more firm, be a little harder on you. All right? But you got to embrace the both, man. It's it's, it's, a, it's, it's a balance. All right? You got to embrace that, that great balance of dealing with that. All right? You got to embrace when the elders do uh, these different videos on instruction and, you know, shit that they don't want to see. And then, you know, embrace it when, you know, they do show brothers, you know, love and they do, you know, give brothers big ups. But you got to take both. All right. You got to take both, man. The good and the sweet, the sweet and the bitter. All right. Hey, one, one reason Jake gets sick and, and our people in the condition they are 
they only like to eat sweets. You go to a corner store, a bodega, whatever, it's only sweet shit in there. All right, cakes, cookies, sweets. You don't have no bitters in there. You don't have no no roots in there. You know what I'm saying? And what happens? Jake gets sweet. Jake gets Jake gets sick from that. All right. Then on the other end of the you know other side of the coin, too much bitter. You know it'll it'll fuck your stomach up. It'll fuck you up too. All right. So you gotta have a little little bit of sweet. You know with the bitter. All right. But I'm coming to an end. Uh, this is a. Uh, Yep, this is 1 Timothy 5 and 17. Let the elders that rule well be counted worthy of double honor, especially those they who labor in the word and doctrine. There you go. Let them be worthy of double honor. All right. So it's just, just something, you know, as, as, a, as, a, as a young man to figure out or, you know, you have somebody watching who, you know, you, you might be young, you might hear certain things and, you know, it might not resonate with you. Right, because it's a it's a complete different generation out here, you know. You got you know young men in the background of a torque video. You, you, you know you got just all kind of just goofy shit, which you know Esau has put all this little metrosexual th stuff into the culture of Jake. You know, and Jake is completely fucked up and turned around. You know, but trusting the way of the elders, you know, trusting the way that's been set up. All right, because they're gonna they're gonna see you become a man, and they're gonna see to it that you go around you go down the right path according to the doctrine. All right, so call Allah Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai Bashim and uh, if you notice it, man, hey, these these people who trust in you know these different administrations of Esau, they always fail. All, every last one of them, all the different leaders, they fail. They might get a job on Fox. They might get a little incentive here or there, but they always fail. All right? And they're only in that position because Esau propped them up. And guess what? That's coming to a close. A Bob and Ball, so the one.